Paul Glenn at Syngenta here. Uh, just quick look at Turf Advisor and um, after a fairly drab last week, maxing out at kind of 22 degrees, end of the school holidays. Looks like we're at the beginning of a little warm up, true to form. Kids go back to school and the weather picks up. So it looks like we may hit 30 degrees this week. Um, so what can we learn from that? Well, let's flip over to my agronomic dashboard as I've got it set up. There we go. Right, so what's going on? So dollar spot pressure. Been fairly low the last week. Um, we go into a little spell this couple of days. But actually, as always, the warm temperature doesn't necessarily mean high dollar spot pressure. But there's one to watch. We're in a little peak here. Well, certainly I am where I am. Um, the other thing to watch is evapotranspiration rates. Uh, evapotranspiration rates have been right there around three to four the last week. So actually sneaking up on us whilst it's been a bit drab. They've been there. So if you've not been irrigating, then um, maybe you're a little drier than maybe you think. So time to get the soil moisture probes out. Looks like we stay right around that four mil per day going forward. So irrigation wise, you're looking to put maybe two mil back on per day at the moment. Um, if you're not doing that because it's been overcast, then good chance those things are drying out quicker than you expect now the other one to watch is that anfrac nose model now this is a temperature based model and you can see running up to now temperatures have been too low but what this is forecasting we're in a two today so this is a zero to four scale four being high pressure zero being low pressure and we moved up to a two but actually if we're looking forward thursday friday saturday sunday all look like high pressure from a temperature point of view trigger days so four is as high as you can get according to the model so very much something to think about there make sure we're going into thursday friday saturday sunday in a stress-free position as possible so have a look where you are with that drought potentially sneaking up on you low moisture content get a good handle on that the next couple of days uh, if you need wetting agents down go for it um, maybe get some rider there in place but just be thinking about that if you can lift those cutting heights going into that then possibly think about it because it looks like we've got a bit of an anfrac nose trigger event coming up and turf advisor has highlighted that by looking at his temperature model and seeing that the rest of this week we may be moving into some pressure periods look i hope that's useful for you uh, i'm going to shut off now because it looks like my internet is pretty slow at the moment um, but when that loading data ad box comes up there you go it will pop up in a second that is one of sean's latest blogs on greencast um, advisory looking at pest tracker and the importance of keeping logging those crane flies which will be coming anytime soon all right take care everyone see you soon